Hello students, welcome to Narayana Online Classes. Today we are discussing 10th Standard Mathematics Assignment Number 45 in the topic Applications of Trigonometry. Now the first question. So the ratio of the length of a tree and its shadow is 1 is to 1 is to 1 by 3. Therefore, for example, uh, this is the length of a tree is uh, 1k by and shadow is 1 by root 3 k then the angle of elevation of this sun so we need to calculate angle of elevation of this sun so tan theta is equals to length of the tree is 1k by and its shadow is 1 by root 3 k here k k get cancel the value is root 3 so tan theta is equals to root 3 so tan theta is equals to tan 60 degrees so here a theta is equals to a 60 degrees here the angle uh, angle of elevation of the sun is 60 degrees here theta is equals to a 60 degrees coming to the next problem here if two towers of height h1 and h2 subtended angles of 60 degrees and 30 degrees respectively uh, at a midpoint of the line joining their feet then h1 is to h2 he is asking for example these are the two points a b is one height of the tower and one more height is uh, for example that is a c d is one more height there is a midpoint e so this is x means so this is also x and angle of elevation c is given so angle of elevation c is 60 degrees that is this is a 60 degrees and the height of the tower is h1 and this is 30 degrees and height of the tower is h2 now he is asking uh, h1 by h2 so here uh, in triangle from the figure uh, in triangle in triangle a b e a b e tan 60 degrees is equals to tan 60 degrees is equals to that is a b h1 by x so tan 60 degrees value is root 3 is equals to h1 by x therefore root 3 into x is equals to h1 that is the first one h1 is equal to root 3 into x in triangle now i am taking this triangle uh, d e c or e d c a uh, tan 30 degrees is equals to tan 30 degrees is equals to h2 by x tan 30 degrees is equals to h2 by x so tan 30 degrees value is a uh, 1 by root 3 is equals to h2 by x therefore x by root 3 is equals to h2 this is equation number 2 from equation 1 and 2 it means h1 by h2 we needed so h1 by h2 is equals to h1 is root 3 into x by h2 is x by root 3 here x x get cancelled and root 3 into root 3 so which is equals to h1 by h2 is equals to h2 is equal to root 3 into root 3 is 3 so 3 by 1 so h1 is to h2 is equal to 3 is to 1 option a coming to the next problem From the top of a building, the angle of elevation of the top of a cell tower is 60 degrees. So there is a building is there. Let it be. This is the ground. And here AB is the height of a building. And and uh, top of a cell tower. There is a cell tower is there. So this is the cell tower. The angle of elevation from the top of the building to the top of a cell tower is 60 degrees let it be this is an uh, imaginary so c d this is a 60 degrees right 
now the height of the building and uh, uh, and the angle of depression to its foot is 45 degrees here this is a 45 degrees these two are parallel and equal therefore this is 45 degrees means uh, this is also a, a 45 degrees right this is also 45 degrees so let it be here if the distance of the building from the uh, tower is 7 meters so here this is a uh, 7 meters bd is 7 meters means uh, uh, that is ae also uh, 7 meters and uh, now we, we need to calculate ab value right so find the height of the tower find the height of a tower let it be this is h1 and this is h2 right a b also h2 so we need to calculate the uh, find a uh, height of the building and height of a tower so let it be from the figure from the figure height of the tower height of a tower that is a cd is equals to h1 plus h2 cd is equals to h1 plus h2 right this is the height of the tower right cd is equals to h1 plus h2 right and uh, and height of a building height of a building that is ab is equals to h2 this is the height of a building and in triangle now i am taking in triangle a c e or a e c so a e c tan 60 degrees is equals to tan 60 degrees is equals to see here a c e by c e by a e so here if you observe that AE is equals to BD parallel and equal right so tan 60 degrees value is root 3 is equals to CE value is H1 by AE value is 7 therefore H1 is equals to 7 root 3 meters now this is a 7 root 3 meters now in triangle in triangle A B D tan 45 degrees tan 45 degrees is equals to how much tan 45 degrees let it be uh, AB by BD so tan 45 degrees value is 1 and AB value is a 7 by uh, sorry AB value is H2 by BD value is 7 therefore H2 is equals to a 7 meters so height of the building is 7 meters right height of a building is height of a building is 7 meters we need to calculate height of tower height of tower that is uh, that is dc is equals to h1 plus h2 that is h1 is 7 plus h2 is 7 root 3 take 7 as common then 1 plus root 3 right which is equals to 7 and 1 plus root 3 value is 1.732 so which is equals to 7 into 2.732 which is equals to 7 to 14 so 19.124 meters the height of a cell tower is 19.14 meters now coming to the next problem a wire of a length 18 meters had been tied with a electrical pole at an angle of elevation a 30 degrees with the ground so there is a pole is there this is the ab is the height of a pole on the ground 
there is a 18 meters uh, 18 meters rope right wire is tied with an angle of elevation of uh, how much with angle of elevation of 30 degrees that is a 30 degrees right uh, with the ground so because it was uh, covering a long distance this is uh, a covering a long distance therefore uh, it is need to be cut it it was cut and tied at an angle of uh, elevation is 60 degrees so the wire is cut and it which is uh, tied at a point uh, 6 x and this is a uh, 60 degrees right and what he is asking how much length of wire was cut how much length of wire was cut see let a length of length of wire that is ac is equals to 18 meters right and length of wire after cutting so after cutting the length of wire is x meters this is the after cutting length of wire is x meters let it be um, here the height of tower is a height of a pole is h so height of height of pole is equals to h meters right h meters now first we need to calculate uh, this relation that is here for example a cd and a d right a wire of uh, length 18 meters had been tied with a electric pole at an angle of 30 degrees elevation and 60 degrees elevation and how much uh, length of wire was cut right so let it be uh, bd is equals to uh, first time taking the relation between these two so the relation between these two in triangle in triangle a b a b d now taking tan 60 degrees so tan or uh, here the opposite by hypotenuse now i'm taking sine sine 60 degrees is equals to opposite is a b by hypotenuse is a d right tan 60 degrees value is root 3 by 2 is equals to a b is h by a d is a d is x therefore therefore h is equals to root 3 by 2 into x meters this is the first one and in triangle in triangle now i am taking the a b c now triangle a b c uh, tan 30 degrees tan 30 degrees is equals to opposite is a b by a c right so a b is a b is equals to tan 30 uh, sorry here sin 30 degrees sin 30 degrees value is 1 by 2 is equals to a b is h by a c is 18 so h is equals to 8 by 2 that is a 9 meter so height of the tower is 9 meters right so substitute h value in equation 1 therefore h is equals to h is equals to root 3 by 2 into x right so h value is 9 is equals to root 3 by 2 into x so send it so 18 by root 3 is equals to x so rationalize the denominator 18 by root 3 into root 3 by root 3 is equals to x therefore x is equals to 18 root 3 by 3 and 6 root 3 is x value if you x is equals to 6 into 1.732 that is a root 3 value and 12 19 
so here a 10 point x is equals to 10.392 here the x value is 10.392 right so now now let it be i am here doing how much length of wire was cut so length of length of wire was cut which is equal to total length of wire is 18 meters by after cutting the length is 10.392 so which is equals to 8 0 and uh, 7 right and 7 point uh, 7.708 7.708 meters of length of wire is cutted now uh, coming to the next problem so that is the length of wire to be cutted equals to 7.708 meters now coming to the next problem So the angle of elevation of the top of a building from a foot of the tower is 30 degrees. So the angle of elevation, right, for example, this is the height of the building and this is the height of a tower, right. So uh, the angle of elevation of the top of a building from the foot of the tower right is a b is the height of a building and c d is the height of a tower then the angle of elevation is a 30 degrees and and the angle of elevation from the top of a uh, tower to the foot of the building is 60 degrees then the distance between a bd is x meters then height of the building is h1 and height of the uh, tower is h2 let it be h2 if the tower is if the tower is 30 meters height so the tower height is given that is a 30 meters the tower height is given that is a 30 meters then we need to calculate the uh, height of a building that is h so let height of a tower height of tower that is CD is equals to 30 meters and uh, height of a building height of a building that is AB is equals to H meters right a distance between distance between foot of the tower foot of building and uh, foot of tower is equals to bd is equals to x meters right x meters now let it be bd is equals to x meters so from triangle in triangle now i'm taking triangle b c d b c d tan 60 degrees is equals to tan 60 degrees is equal to opposite is cd by bd right so tan 60 degrees value is root 3 is equal to uh, cd is 30 by bd is x therefore x is equal to 30 by root 3 x is equal to 30 by root 3 meters that is the distance between a bd now we need to calculate h value height of the building so in triangle a b d so tan 30 degrees is equals to a b by in this triangle or tan 30 degrees is equals to opposite by adjacent side that is x so tan 30 degrees value is 1 by root 3 is equals to a b value is h by x x value x so uh, do cross multiplication so x is equals to h root 3 so here the x value is x is equals to 
एक्स इज इक्वल टू थर्टी बाई रूट थ्री इज इक्वल टू एच रूट थ्री फोर एच इज इक्वल टू थर्टी बाई रूट थ्री इंटू वन बाय रूट थ्री सो विच इज इक्वल टू थर्टी बाय थ्री और टेन मीटर सो हाइट ऑफ अ बिल्डिंग इज टेन मीटर्स सो हाइट ऑफ अ बिल्डिंग इज टेन मीटर्स और थैंक यू चिल्ड्रन